Hey there, YouTube. Jaffer here today with another Pioneer deck list for you. This time I wanted to go take a step back and play a little bit of my favorite uh, from probably around uh, maybe shortly after I start, got into Pioneer. Uh, my traditional way I enjoy playing Magic. On a green Stompy, but with Nykthos. So uh, if you enjoy playing Nykthos and playing Coletta Company together or playing one of the cards, be sure to hang out and check this de uh, deck list out. Uh, it's tons of fun. Uh, you ramp into things and play Coco and sink your mana into certain creatures or other things. Uh, but uh, before we go into the deck list, if you've been enjoying my content and you haven't yet so far, feel free to subscribe to the channel, like the video as well, comment below what you're excited about uh, this deck list uh, or video, and uh, what else you'd like to see from me for some content. So let's go hop into the deck list. Okay, so the deck list itself, it is Monogreen Devotion or Monogreen Stompy with a Devotion package, Nykthos. So obviously you play your Nykthos Shrine to Nyx. It's your mana, uh, Lana makes a ton of mana from all your Devotion, obviously. You know, in the Karn builds, you know, everywhere in Jank decks and everything. Uh, but we are playing things like our Mandorks, our eight Mandorks, Lana War Elves and Elvish Mystic. Playing one of both Nissa to help just have another one drop tur uh, for turn one uh, if needed and help dig. And it's also Devotion. Uh, for a two drop package, burn your emissary to help accelerate into a uh, like more devotion on turn two. So turn one dork uh, or mana dork into uh, turn two, play Nykthos, burning tree emissary, and then make three mana, play a three drop. Or if you're lucky, multiple burn tree emissaries into a Coco or a Vivian Arcbow Ranger uh, are playing my favorite two drop in green. Or elf pack leader, two mana, three, three, solid stats, draws you cards, you attack a power six or greater in total, uh, and you can pump it to be a five, three. Uh, and get trampled. Uh, playing a Singleton Outland, Outland Liberator, this could be a scavenging ooze. I'm not fully decided on that yet, but I wasn't liking having the disenchant effect in the main board in addition to the two Besages. So three disenchant effects in total, uh, two to blow up lands. Uh, and then in our three drop package, we're playing four Steel of Champion, uh, which is just three mana, five, four. Uh, really good back in that standard and decent in this format at times uh it doesn't feel the best when there's a sheltered running around but good stats where it can't be blocked by a lot of certain creatures uh because it can't be blocked by power two or less and we have ogre troll just a staple in any mono green devotion deck nowadays green mana four four uh with trample and has a rec good recursive effect uh and then we also do have a single pelucanos on a single ronus the indomitable and a single primal adversary so we're kind of using those as mana sinks for all of our mana with Nykthos. And then in our four drop slot, we have our four Collective Company. You know what the card does. And we have four Vivian Arcbow Ranger, favorite Planeswalker in the game. Uh, so plus one, you have to put two counters, uh, or one counter on up to two creatures, uh, or two counters on one creature, and they gain Trample Tone turn. Minus three, you get to have a creature bite another creature. Uh, so deal damage to another creature or Planeswalker. And minus five, you get to reveal a creature card you own from outside the game and put it into your hand. So your sideboard, which our sideboard is also a wish board. Uh, now, going into the sideboard, our actual sideboard cards are going to be Primal Mites for fight spells, Shaper Sanctuary for a card draw against mid-range decks or sacrifice, uh, a single unlicensed hearse, and uh, a quest and beast for against like roll if we need to or wish target our other wish targets are gonna be a single voracious hydra for a fight spell uh and if we need mid game uh, not one liberator two scavenging nooses which you can board in uh and two sky slashers because it feels like there's been a lot of, of blue white spirits running around um at least to me it has felt like that uh so i figured why not let's just go ahead and toss that in as a two mana flash it can't counter pro blue uh and then we have cityscape leveler eight mana uh, when it cast, you know it does, and it has the unearth ability as well, which is really nice. Then these two, last two are strictly only wish targets: Ulamog, the ceaseless hunger. Uh, usually the game ends if that resolves, and it can't be answered at all. And Decimator of the Provinces, it's just a overrun effect, uh, an overrun creature effect. Also, it's an Eldrazi boar. Like that's a cool creature type. But anyways, let's go ahead and hop into the league and check out the matches, and I hope you enjoy the video. How bad do you think this is going to go, chat? This hand's keepable. All getting the six cards. If they're on traditional mono green, I'm going to cry. Not really.
Starting a game with five cards. They're probably on monogram. Oh, they're not. They're on lows, lows to a combo, right? Trip to Nikthos and Coco in that order. <laughs> They have to be on Lotus Field here. Yeah, they are. Thespian stage. What do we draw? Burning tree. Isn't blue white lotus? Yeah. If it was blue white lotus, we have a terrible time here. Burning tree. Uh, burning tree. This thing. All right. Did anybody get predictions in? Leyland. It's actually good though. Blue White Lotus is. Yeah. It has more exile effects against Honor Green. Panicle Sanctum tapped. Draw Forest. They have a Seiju? Nope. So far, no. I totally forgot about Lotus Field when building the stack chat. So that's great. I, uh, ooze. We need ooze. Ooze and hers. Well, we at least have that. We don't have anything to stop. Ooze and hers helps. Uh, for cuts, Trim Pack Leader, maybe a Vivian. Run twenty nine creatures. Oath, I'm considering cutting here. Oath is just is just here as a one drop to help uh, fill a, one, a, a turn one play to help dig for things if needed, and it's devotion. We'll do that. Uh, that turn two Proctor against two. Yes. <laughs> no, you're right. <laughs> that would be bad. Here's my vanilla two two. Oh, chat. Does anybody have any? Does anybody in chat have any cool wallets? I got my Bob Ross wallet still. I had. I got that years ago. I think out of all the Planeswalker cards, Vivian Arqua Ranger is my favorite. The Spanish Farewell. That's pretty cool. Ooh, okay, we're on the draw. Opponents mulliganing the six. Do I risk it? We're up a game. Because if I chop deck Nykthos, I'm going to be a happy person. We got two draws until we till turn two. I, the more I'm talking about this, the more the more I'm I'm talking myself into keeping it. I need somebody to to be reasonable and tell me not to keep it. Because right now I'm gonna click the keep button. Second. I mean it's okay if we actually draw a land. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna do it. 
I'm gonna do it. I know. Sorry, Storm Breath. Literally, literally nothing can go wrong. And strain runs no well from Will. True, true, true. Belk gets popped. We could take him to the air airport. They all gonna five cards. It's looking better and better. Begin the game with five cards. Temple of Mystery. They scry to the bottom. We did it. Awesome. We're now having an awesome turn two play. <laughs> I knew that card was the top, by the way. Are you psychic? <laughs> All right. So we're going to go turn two into BT into uh, Steel Leaf Ch uh, Champion. Because I don't want to play OGT with no forest in the field. What are they doing here? Oh. Uh, close field? Close field. Goes to our turn. Burning tree. Nykthos. Steel Leaf. What? Cancel. Why is it? Hold on. Oh. Oh, that's why. Okay. It was trying to use the. It was trying to use the red green to cast a Steel Leaf instead of going in. That's a Vizier. Okay. So. Three, four, five, six. I can just toss out two, three, threes. And then next we can have Coco. That. I should not summon the elf. Die right now. I know I can. Green. Not blue. And strains. Well, so opponent's going to be doing this for a while. Jermoka! Oh. Okay. You were getting served? Yes. Uh, we get the Coco on our turn? I like to imagine the lowest field players are just supporting streamers by giving them time to talk to chat. That's the only way they are villains. I mean, like, if I make my Lair the Hydra a big giant creature, they are going to just chump it with the O3. I'm just going to eat their graveyard. Is it my floating mana? Um, last turn. Yes, I'm going to pass a floating. 
when in their lands. I mean, I had floating mana. Like I, I guess I could have saved clicks. Yeah, I know. I'm burning my clock. On. They have zero cards in hand. Find two mana sinks. Um, I mean, I might as well do it to all my lands, right? Might be a bad idea, though, at the same time. Two. Three. Four, five. Doesn't untap them though, right? Done. Or. I was totally doing that wrong at first. Do the last one. Whoops. Back in the lovely number. Coco. Uh, all right, opponent. I will attack next turn. That is scary, though. Oh, <laughs> oh if they have that. Oh, no. <laughs> Math is for blockers, though, not for green players. Uh, so this hand is very medium. If I, had a, if I had a mana to work. This hand's better. I don't really want to go down to five cards. I'll keep it. Feels bad, though. Go to lose. Sorry, but the last match was too free. Yeah. That has to be something bad. So it has to be something bad. Stop trying for it. What? What? You... <laughs> Fable Passage. What, what are we playing? Is this Grixis or Demir? Uh, so I believe it's either going to be Grixis or Demir, Archfiend Depravity. Because last I saw, the, they're the only decks that play Fable Passage. Ah. 
Aha! It is Grixis. I've seen Grixis Giants. It's not. I've seen an Explorer. Luke. Are they making days? Are doing make disappear? They are. I'm sad. Uptick, target, target. Cancel that one. Minute. Yes, I'm going to lose my fluid. Man. Okay. Now, next turn, we have a ton of mana. If our board sticks around, might have a board wipe. Or is this Shelly? It is Archfiend. Okay, we're, we're good. Add in Storm. Storm to Festival? That would be a different deck then. Okay, so three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I have the mana. I want something with that though. Opponent's not gonna be happy. I'm gonna get Ulamog. I am going to cast Ulamog. Going to get rid of this and that. Ranch cry. Yeah, we prefer tri tribute sometimes, but I. If we had more five power creatures, maybe Henge. He does a turn five, Lumog. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Sick. <laughs> so the thing about this, I have a funny clip I made into a TikTok, uh, and it's a YouTube short as well, where I had a blue eye control a control opponent where I did that to them, and it was like late in the game though, and they did they casted March of the Otherworldly Light for ten on their turn. <laughs> I still remember that was hilarious when it happened. That man was desperate in the <laughs> All right, we're gonna cut an Othanissa or bring two shapers in. I'm gonna cut a land where El Elvish Mystic. I'm gonna bring in my second out and liberator. Uh we're on the draw. Pop an opponent that match. I don't remember. I think we did, but I don't remember exactly. I think it actually got into a YouTube video I did back then. For Vigilant, so it can get Emperored. Eight mana to face a Deluge and have four for Emperor. Yeah. Um. I guess Primal Might could be a thing here, too. On the dumps and just roll. <laughs> Artless. <laughs> I think we actually cut an Outland Liberator here for uh, our two drop to bring in. I, I kind of want to bring Palomites in, but I feel like it's kind of not worth it at the same time because they're just going to have a bunch of removal. 
they're gonna have extinction events and stuff all right we'll go with this chat there's an ad in about less than two minutes also chat how are you liking the webcam here like kind of like Condensed inwards and not overlapping the game. Played that Storm Herald combo yet? The Herald combo. What combo's that? Are you talking about giants? Like the, the silly giant deck people played a long time ago in standard? No? Okay. No, I haven't. If my opponent was confused. add less than a minute, chat. Oh, that thing you were asking me about. No, I haven't played that. Um, I haven't played it personally, but I've seen it happen in like historic. <laughs> I've never seen that card. That's funny. That looks not very nice. Okay, thank you. Uh, if you look at the VOD from the other day, you'll notice uh, that it was kind of like a little bit bigger, so it's protruding outwards onto the game board a little bit. I liked how that looked, but some people gave me feedback of changing it. Uh, it's going to be a bit... Oh, I actually forgot to turn these on. <laughs> Storm Breath, it's okay. And Pioneer and Ruthless because Storm Herald attaches on bond to you. Targeting to attach because you never target. Okay. What's going on with the opponent? Okay, there we go. We're mulling this. Uh, well, actually, I could keep it. They're mulling the six cards. Chat, we're on the draw in this match. We have a turn to play. They do play Thoughtseize and Fatal Pushes. But if we draw a turn three land, untap land, that is green, or we a turn one layer of the Hydra, we can cast OGT still. I think the hand's okay, but not the best. I did cut a dork. I'm going to keep it. Thoughtsies. Hey, Vivian. There's another Vivian. That's a lot of Vivians. Oh, they discard here. Oh, did anybody see that Fable, the Mirror Breaker, got a ban in Alchemy and another card got mer nerfed all of a sudden for no reason? Like, there was no warning at all that it was happening. It just happened. Yeah, Crucius got ban uh, nerfed to be a 3-1, and then Fable got banned when they don't supposedly ban cards in that format.
take a Vivian. I mean, if people enjoy it, people enjoy it, but like, it's not for me. It seems like it's not a lot, not for a lot of people in my chat. Are they fatal pushing? Oh, they're digging through time. Really dead. I, I believe a lot. It's like more of a casual format and done anything, isn't it? Bronze opponents, true. Table. Bent, sure. Got two cards left in hand. We're not dead. Not really looking that favored for us. All right. No, no. F6. No, I get that too, Storm Breath. It kind of feels like they could be doing other things. Archfiend. We die in two turns, basically. Digging through time. Never dead, for sure. All right. So, I don't want to cut these on the play. I can cut you. We're kind of going, ba we're going back to our normal 60. I'm going to do that instead. Yeah, I thought some of the alchemy cards seemed kind of cool, but like weird at the time.
or some mechanic cord. It was like a goal to like make online only thing, which they did succeed, but like they managed it poorly. Uh, we can keep this. We have a turn three play. I'm not expecting the elf to live though. If our elf lives, that would be sick. If, if, if elf doesn't live, I hope we draw a land. <laughs> Emulgan to six cards. On paper by far, but online. Yeah. That's cool. We got to keep that. And I think that dies to not stop. Cool. Uh, land where elves living would be really sick here. I think they want revolt to kill the four three. Okay. So, do we want to go Coco here? Because like they have double black right now, they don't have any board wipes they can do. And they're just gonna be in some big trouble anyways. Like they need four mana for a board wipe. They they can't do like a brother's end. I kind of just want to go Coco here. That's 200 IQ. <laughs> I think we're gonna go Coco here and just be happy with it. Since they're tapped out. Usually I don't like Owen Coco on my on my turn. Drown in Sour or Sorrow. Uh, what does that card do again, chat? Can somebody do the card command for that? If they do have that, then I do lose everything on my board pretty much. Team vents. Table. Oh, okay, okay. We're going to play Vivian and punch the goblin. Uh, true. Ritual set is one I need to worry about. Own it. Strider. It's that raid. I need to change the size of that thing. Shout out to Strider Stone. Strider Stone's an awesome content creator. Welcome, Commander Celebrity. Hi, my name is Jaffer. Currently, we're playing some. Uh, Mono Green Devotion Stoppy uh, in a Pioneer League at the moment. Hope you all enjoyed Strider Stream. Sort of exiled like Drown, but I can't remember the name of it. Naturally. What did you do today? What what cool shenanigans were you doing today? 
broke arena to the point that Sparky flipped the table. <laughs> oh, that sounds great. Okay, they got an island. This is a board wipe? No, they're digging through time. And we win. Cool. And play a Nyctos ramp, their own one. Oh, is there a monogreen devotion? I am not in a good not in for a good time. Are they on stock? Oh, they're playing this of Vital Force. Which does technically ten points. Else does. I mean, that is true. A good opponent. All right, Strider. Thank you. I appreciate it. You have a wonderful night. All right, what card does the opponent pick? Elvish Mystic. All right, we're going to toss a Steel Leaf out here. They're getting priority still. We draw a burning tree. That'll be for next turn. Play Steel Life Champion. Yeah, I just realized you everybody doesn't get to hear the sound effects on Moto. But I do. Does anybody want to hear the sound effects? Does anybody like the sound effects in Moto? Want to hear them? I can turn it on. Back in. Never heard them. They are. Di it's different. There's a Nykthos. There's a Cavalier. I got much faster. I did not know that. I think Chat can hear him now. Activate Nykthos. Okay, undo. Ah. Uh. Okay, I gotta hope for Vivian and my devotion to live net for through a turn. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Because we can get Ulamog and go Ulapogin. I need to get that an emote. I need I need Ulapog as an emote. Does anybody else agree? What's opponent do against an Ulamog? Oh, okay. Now I'm sad. I am very sad. I'm sad. <laughs> That's funny. Player Oath and Nissa. Trigger is going to go happen.
Come on. Guess I'll grab that. Order. Same thing they do every night. Um, I think we kind of lose here. Almost. Seven, eight, eight. I attack in with my burning tree and pump all my mana into it. Bad. Because they're gonna bot. They're gonna bo uh pop our steely for sure. I think we just pass. If a Besaju in the grave, they play only one Besaju if they're on their current, if they're on their same list as before. Dora. Seven. Untap Nykthos. Make a ton of mana. Or are they going to play something else? Nope, oh, we can't listen to that. That is copyright music. Portal to Phyrexia. Frexit is an Ulamog. Ah, uh, what do else do you want to do here? Like, I want ooze, but... That. Yes, I'd like to play first. Yes, I'd like to keep that hand. They mulligan the six cards. Mulligan the five cards. Keep the five. Keep the five.
Uh, a forest. Alright, burning tree. Pick those. Make mana. Um, I'm gonna go steel leaf. And pass. That makes me sad. All right, what do we draw? What do we draw? What do we draw? Draw forest. I feel like if I attack with Steely, they're going to block, and I think I'm okay with that. That puts Devotion down, but they might not be willing to. Uh, what I'm going to do, though, is this. And turn two forests into creatures. Oh, they don't block because they need the devotion. Land. OGT. Publish Mystic. They have one card in hand. I have them. I like it in paper. I don't really like it in moto. I have it in paper. I have my plate, my three copies in paper in that art. I don't like the foiling of it. I will say that. I think we just attack with Steel Leaf and Primal Adversary. It is going to ramp them, but get some creatures out of the way. I don't have Nykthos and a uh, big spell. Forest. All right, whether you do, do, uh, Transform. I need a fight spell. Not a fight spell. Uh, send the primal adversary in. We trade. F6. Elf.
Could we have gotten away with 20 lands instead of 22? Maybe a 21. What do, you th what do we think about that, chat? Probably 21. I feel like maybe 20 is a little pushing it. Aggressiveness, maybe. Yeah, there's an ad break and oh, it started. Hey, quick. How you doing? Hope you're doing well. Got a 4-4. Four four. So they're not prioritizing devotion now. Prioritizing staying alive. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Alive. Staying alive. What they find here? Still in debate and playing an Diablo Four season. So, what do you get in the new seasons? You gotta layer the Hydra. Primal Might was a good draw. We're going to just pump everything into it and attack out. Let everyone attach. D4 is meh. Nick, we got game two. All right. Do we think we're going to get a game three against traditional mono green devotion? with our stompy devotion deck. I'm kind of not liking how the card is looking down below in this overlay. I liked how the last overlay, overlay looked. This one just feels like it's not as clean looking at the picture of the card. I gotta like probably like really take time to edit that out. I'm not good at Photoshop. Do it a black background. The yellow. The overlay. I think what I need to do also with the picture of the card down there, I need to bring the crop upwards a little bit and then make it round inside of there somehow instead of just sharp corners around the card at least i can agree with that i think like maybe leaving yellow on the camera border and then yellow on the top bar up over there and down below there might be okay i kind of don't want to board anything Keep it. Then the uh, outward bottom edge of the client. 
I, what I was thinking earlier of like just completely removing those two sides of it and just leaving it kind of like how what uh, Mengu has on his streams. It just deal with the gray background of the card by it. I'm all in the six. They begin the game in six cards. Game of Cops up. The only Diablo game I played was Diablo 2. I enjoyed that. We're gonna play this attack in with for one at the Kiora. Last Diablo worth playing. I played it with a friend too, and that's all. That's the only time I played it. Played uh, it's multiplayer. Five years, but they did it. Uh, oven special key. Hey, look at that! We got a besager for that. That's a Karn. I'm scared. <laughs> what did they get here? They get a boat. Well, 100 D4 had stopped playing two weeks ago. Desire. Your desire to play anymore. You're back D4. Resurrected. Actually, I think what we're going to do here is hold on to Burning Tree. We're going to Coco on their uh, end step or response to something. Oh, part of the equipment RNG. So is it like, is it like, you tr how do you get equipment in that game? Is it kind of like similar to, uh, um, Booster packs, I guess you could say. Glad uh, on Arena, you can play Zenigos and World Swine Warring Combo. Hey, Harding. Yeah, that, that combo is pretty co cool and fun. I updated my Arena client today, and I decided I'm not going to touch it. <laughs> and here comes the boat. Targeting our Werewolf Pack Leader. Drop them when you pop them. Oh, okay. Horse armor, which is insane. Blizzard's Pinata. Okay, interesting. All right, what are they gonna do here? Mass genocide numbers kind of game. Oh, they get the might stone and weak stone. Six, seven, eight, nine. So, sorry, chat. One second. Play this. Play this. Got 
that and that. Play you. Pop you. Pop you. Yes, we're going to lose mana. Go to combat. Uh, go after Kiora, go after Karn, go after Face. That seemed like a really good turn there. <laughs> and tap. Halo Infinite go again. Is that the online Halo game? I think we're good here. Mostly. Had they destroyed their player base on LOL. Five mana. Casting that. Are they drawn or are they blowing up something? Okay, fine. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Well, I am going to end the game, I think. Uh, let's look at our sideboard again. Uh, this thing costs 10 mana. Plus 2, plus 2, trample. That ends the game, right? 5, 6, 7, 8. It has haste itself. 7, 7. Yeah, that should be good enough. Minus. A 10 mana. Cast Decimator. Everything's big. Swing. Hit face. Win game. Modern Coco takes the match. Nice. Okay, we're on to play. I could potentially keep this, but I feel like I might be doing a bit too much. No chat on screen anymore. Uh, I'm trying a new thing out. Uh, I'm trying to have card preview so it's easier for chat to read the cards. I'm kind of not liking it too much. Because sometimes some people do complain or men exp express how they can't read the cards fully. We're in a mulligan. It's smarter than mulligan. We'll keep this one. to dump the board state into oh is this like an elemental deck are we gonna sell elementals Laird the hydra and yorion nope Okay. That was a good draw.
Play you, play you. Go to combat. I got a feeling of that too. I'm okay with trading there, so I don't have a blocker for my other stuff. As much as I would like to flip Pelucanos, I think we have to hold up Coco here. Go to combat. I feel like there might be a board wipe coming. Deal to the trigger. Or 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. I mean, actually, we're going to box. Okay. Um, yeah, we're not going to activate anything then. We're just going to let that happen. We're gonna take some damage. Yeah, I'm expecting a Wander Emperor though. If they mainboard sell the wreckage, okay. I don't know much what they're doing. Like, I kind of want Primal Mites and I kind of want Quest and Beast. Yeah, I think Quest and Beast is fine. Like, and I kind of want Prowl Might. Like, I kind of want to cut Othanis and a Dork. On a Shaman Toolbox. Creature. True. They could be a Toolbox deck, yeah. That, that could be true, too. Like, I kind of want Prowl Mites, Quest and Beast, and I almost want Out and Liber Out Liberator, but I don't think so. Retreat seems awkward. It's more to help enable to in uh, increase our Vivian turn. No, I'm actually drinking water at the moment. It, I use this for water as well. Change the green light vehicles. Okay. So I think we're going to cut a Coco. And then, oh, what else do we cut here? I don't want to cut Vivian. I guess we can cut a dork. I'll cut a dork. As I say, how are you doing? On the draw, this hand is okay if we draw land. Otherwise, we can go turn one elf and two turn two werewolf pack leader. I'm gonna risk it since we're on the draw. We get two tur two turns to draw a land. We're up a game. Up a game part's a bad argument. Right? We drew the land. Forest. 
voice a resurgence. Okay, okay, okay. Water bottle for water. You use your rogue cup for powder right now. Egro cup? Okay. Um, so I would like to get I would like power pack there in the field, but we have to double spell apply pressure. You're not paying for that trigger. I am surprised how many times that trigger has come up tonight of like actually happen. Two times, I think. Eclipse Apparition. We are probably going to play Vivian here and punch the Skyclave. Good, got a new keycap set. Awesome. You're only a few of man things. I mean, true, but I'm like, yeah. I mean, like, so we can go Vivian and punch, or we can go attack a burning tree, hold up collecting company. They have four cards in hand. Both my cards look funny. <laughs> hey, Cothern. Uh, part of me wants to play it safe and go Coco on their turn. I'm going to do it. I'm going to go attacking right now with the burn tree. Do they block? They don't. Stage you. Lenware Elves. Better seller play us. Yeah, I'm playing that right now. Oh boy. Are they gonna so are they gonna reset Skyclay? Nope, Sky too. All right, they're playing it safe. I forgot about that. Uh, yep. James too. I forgot about that thing. Let's just get rid of that token now. Uh, when they scryed, uh, I forgot to look at that. They scryed to the bottom. Go to combat. In the 5 4. F6. Yeah, Cutherin, it's pretty good music. I'm liking the Pix uh, 8 bit music. Like, like a uh, old school video game music. Land, Temple Garden, Hat. No reason to shock it in. They buy Yorian. Comes on. Is it YouTube? Yeah. Four. Break a lot. Yeah. Yeah, basically they are. Um. Ha ha ha. <laughs> I'm actually over on YouTube right now as well, Cothern. Um. Yes. I 
and in for six. Actually, chat, speaking of YouTube, be sure to go check out my latest YouTube video. There's my latest YouTube video right there. All right, is this gonna be a Yorian? What? Vanquish the Horde. That happened. Dorian. Okay. Draw, draw a forest. Yes. <laughs> Hey, Cuthern. Uh For anybody that's watching over here, too, uh, be sure to uh, like the uh, stream as well. Can't imagine that. Or I can make that to a 4-4. Four, four. Uh, we're going to go to hidden for 5. Hope everybody in chat's doing right. Hey, they're down to two. That they didn't block. Yes, it does. It definitely does. Playing what about the music? Otherwise, I would not be playing it. Going after Vivian? Sure. Are we expecting to sell the wreckage then? Or a collected company? Chat, what do you think? I still have to set up my bot commands over here. Well. What? What is going on here? We're in second main phase. Okay. I mean, I got the game here. I have zero cards in hand. Let's play Burning Tree, we animate the lair. What the fuck is an Eldrazi boar? That's an Eldrazi boar. X is three. Combat. And I've rolled with it since, uh, basically, or some things. And it just happened to be a good content creation name, I thought. I don't want to go down to five, chat. I really don't want to go down to five, but I think we have to. Chat, I need your decision. I'm going to leave this to chat. Do we risk it and keep a handful of five, three drops? Or we go to five? Oh, we should go to five. We're going to go to five. We're going to go to five. Okay. Uh, well, we got two dorks. We got two dorks. Okay. We're going to put Ronus and Vivian back, I think. Actually, hold on. No, no. We're going to put Pelucanos and Vivian back. No. <laughs> That's amazing. No land, so totally. Oh, Thossies? Duress? Ha <laughs> ha, opponent. Ha <laughs> ha. Keep the hand, except it's five drops of normal mono green. Yeah, and you're on. 
We're both on the same amount of lands, actually, yeah. Hey, we drew a land. Sick. Uh, let's get our five drop away out before they can actually thought seize that away. Or three drop. Our inf uh, indestructible creature. They are Ractus mid-range playing Blood Tithe Harvester here. Yeah. Seiju. Sick, sick. Okay, we're just going to play this as a land. Uh, play Dork. I didn't need to tap that down. I don't know why I just did that. Oh, do you believe in top deck for lands? Well, finding Collective Company would be great here. <laughs> the song name. <laughs> the song's name, I might lose. It kind of feels like that. Kind of feels like that right now. All right, so what's going to happen here probably is they're going to pop our Outland Liberator. In response, we're going to pop their Blood Token because they're going to want to play a Fable to Mirror Breaker without it dying. Hey, why? Yeah, it's, it's almost 12 here. They're either going to let this go or they're going to cycle. They're cycling. Okay. Cycle a hive of the eye tyrant. Play a blood crypt. Tapped. Got to push my dork. Sure. What do we draw? You draw a land. I guess we're going to go ahead and just pump. And attack for three. Because I got nothing else I can do. Opponent has five cards in, which is pretty scary. Four cards in hand. That's sheltered. Sheltered. Might be game here. Because all we can really do is play Burning Tree Emissary, float the mana into Nykthos, pump on to... Probably just Burning Tree so we can attack with Ronus, but that doesn't do anything. You have animated a 4-4 and swing. How? I don't, I don't have Lair of the Hydra. Uh, this is Besaidra here. And it takes uh, three mana. It takes three mana to, to pump a Thronus. I think we're probably just going to go to game two in just a moment here. I don't see any benefit in doing anything right now. It's okay. Um, I'm going to let the mana float away, unfortunately. I'm going to hope that they don't realize I can pump with Ronus and block with Ronus. I'd be pretty sick if they can do that if they don't remember Ronus' ability. Uh, Calum Kamolo Momo, thanks for that follow. Appreciate that. We're playing Dreadbore. Not quite dead.
Collect a company be a sick draw. Come on, Coco. Snake Buster. Land. That is a Vivian. That is a good play. A good draw. Um. Like Vivian's going to die though. That's a pro that's a bad thing. Like that's something we have to accept that'll happen. I'm gonna pass. Like if they want Vivian gone, they gotta attack with Hive here. Yep, that's what they're doing. Chat, do you think we're going to get this game one all of a sudden? I am having some severe doubts. We rip a Coco? Maybe that'll be a different? Nope, that's not a Coco. They're out cards? Eh, kind of. I mean, they got two cards now. They can go to three cards here. Nazis. Aha! You shock yourself! Draw a card. Blood Tithe? Blood Tithe. Got top would have probably done it. Probably. One of our mana sinks would be awesome too to draw. Like the wolf would be cool. Yay. So I can pump twice on Elvish Mystic and Swain with Ronus. They go to nine. They're probably okay with. Maybe I should actually play the Nykthos off a card. They're going to kill Elvish Mystic probably. All right, do you take it or do you block it? Take it becomes knight. They kill off our dude. They draw a card. Three cards in hand. Blood Tithe. That is Blood Tithe number three. Blood Tithe number three. New Bake Buster. Hydra is a mint mana sink, but not that great right now. If they find their Blood Tithe number fourth Blood Tithe, they can actually kill off my Ronus. That is a bit scary. Go to 11, we go to 10.
Player an attack there. I mean, I could have, yes. No, Lair would still be a 4 4 creature. about that roll you're a little late we're just we're dead now we're dead to attack uh animate hive attack all we lose two on attack and yeah we're just dead no matter what There's an ad break in five minutes. On the play, I'm going to bring one shaper in for an oath. Kind of want scoos. What are those? What happened to that guy? <laughs> Damn, Daniel. What are those? Or was that the damn Daniel with that guy? Or was that something separate? That was something separate, wasn't it? Except about the same time frame. Yeah, they're both in the Vine era. I kind of want to bring news in chat because I'm worried like we can it's good to like get rid of Kroxa, but like at the same time we shouldn't worry about too much about that. I'll do that. We'll try this out. Yes, I'd be like to on the play. Yeah. Yes, I would like to be on the play. Yes, I like to keep this hand. And I would like to keep my elf around. To turn three. And my hand. I'd like to keep my hand too. Okay. Goodbye, Coco. We'll go to combat, poke in for one. On a ridge, fatal push. No fatal push. That's going BT instead of attacking with Elf. Yeah, I didn't fully think about that. <laughs> I'm going to be honest. I did not, th did not think about that at all. I totally should have done that. So I begin two, three draws this turn. I was just rushing through that turn when I should have just taken my, taken my time. Now, this is going to be the person that plays Path of Peril, and I'm going to cry. Nope. Okay. Go to combat. Beta push. 
No, Noxious Grasp. Okay, sure, that happens. I get one draw then. Draw an Elvish Mystic. I actually should have pumped that. There's no reason for me to hold up stuff. Definitely no reason for me to hold up stuff. I am subject to a board wipe now. Pump true. I'm totally not playing that correctly at all. They go land ritual set, then I deserve it. Sick! Or we just win. <laughs> okay, let's cut into elf here. Um, I'll make extinction event. I mean, they're at five life though, right? Was it five or four? Um, and we had two elves. Like, even would have been to play there to go for. And then they would have to slowly deal with just two elves, which is just super easy. They're just one ones. But if they don't have any answers, then that does become a big problem. So I think the only thing we're going to change is cut elf and bring in Shaper Sanctuary. Five? Okay. I think that's all we're going to do here is change. Like, Quest Abuse isn't really that great in this matchup. On the draw, since we're not being as aggressive as on the play, we that's why I'm bringing a second Shaper in. I could cut another pack leader and go up an Outland Liberator. The pop the uh, pop the uh, uh, reckoner bank busters and the fables. I think we're gonna do that. I think I'd rather do we rather BT a uh, BT for that then. Might be fun. I'm just gonna run it this way. And I am trying. That's a mulligan. It's a definite mulligan. Albert, welcome to the stream. I kind of want to ship the Atlanta Worlds back because turn one's going to be Shaper Sanctuary instead of Dork. If they thought sees us, that sucks. Feels bad, but I'm gonna play it. Get the draw cards. Shaper Sanctuary isn't as great against a Sheldred, though. I will say that. Play OGT. You're not attacking in. Crack in the blood token. Discard a Sheldred. Either have a second Sheldred or they need. Okay. There goes Ronus.
They have a second sheltered or they need a land. This publish mystic. Go to combat. Send you in. Yes, I, yeah, I'm gonna eat Ronus. I was thinking about sending Ooze in, but I think that's kind of hurts too much to lose it. I didn't think of. I would think I was thinking that they would want to keep it around since they miss a land drop. Like they're missing a land. Uh, we are not going to block that because that could turn into 5-5. Five, five. Take it. Land. Finally, finally got a land. So what we could do here, we could play Burning Tree, float mana into Nykthos, play new Nykthos, make more mana, animate layer for a ton, pack in, and force them to block a Blood Tithe. They're not going to want to block a Sheldred. Unless they actually want to kill off the layer. That kind of feels like a waste at the same time, though. I do it. Or they might just take it, okay. And they get a ton of life of return. They get two, two life, which is a lot against at us. Yes, I'd like to draw a card, even though I take two damage from it. Happens.
Belly left on deck. They probably only have one. Yeah, I agree. Why am I doing that? I should be blocking that thing. I guess this one could be turned into a five power instead of that way. Nazis. Grab a Seiju. That does not help out. They have game. Uh, almost. They have a Fatal Push. They have game. Turn my lair into a creature. They just push it or use a kill spell on it. I don't see how we live through this. There it is. GG. All right, so that was some mono green electric company devotion stompy stuff. Wish target things. That, that, that was mono green stompy. So I hope you enjoyed the deck. I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, and if you did, always, all, if you did, as always, be sure to like the video, comment below what you liked about it, subscribe to the channel. I'd greatly appreciate that. That does help support the channel i am going to be trying to get more content out here more consistently uh so this week it's just two youtube videos next week i will be having three uh and i'll be trying to stick with three uh but i am also trying out live streaming here on youtube as well uh so if you do want to check out my live content i do stream primarily on twitch and check that out as well uh five days a week over there on twitch.tv slash chaffer and uh if you come by make sure to say hi follow the channel over there and uh check out the content but everyone, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next video.